Ruth chapter 1, I'm reading. God bless you. Verse number 6. six. And then she arose, that is Naomi, with her daughters-in-law, that she might return from the country of Moab, for she had heard in the country of Moab how that the Lord has visited his people in giving them bread. Wherefore she went forth out of the place where she was, and the two daughters-in-law with her. And they went on the way to return unto the land of Judah. And Naomi said unto her daughters-in-law, Go, return each, each of you to a mother's house. The Lord deal kindly with you as you have dealt with me, with the dead and with me. In verse number 9. Then the Lord grant you that you may find rest, each of you, in the house of a husband. Then she kissed them and said, Goodbye. But they all cried with loud voice. Verse number 10. And they said unto her, Surely we will return with thee unto thy people. Special for life. Verse number 10. And they said unto her, Surely we will return with thee unto thy people. And Naomi said, Turn again, my daughters. Why will you go with me? Are there yet any more sons in my womb that they may be your husband? Turn again, my daughters. Go your way. For I am too old to have a husband. And if I were to have a husband, and I should have any husband also tonight and should i bear sons but in verse number 13 terrible stuff is happening right there would you wait for them until they've grown would you stay for them from having husband no my daughters pack your bags go because it it grieves me much for your sake that you your hand or rather the hand of the lord is gone out against me and they lifted up their voice and cried loud and opa kissed her and said goodbye mama zala and in verse number 15 and she said and ruth said behold uh, right in verse 15 Naomi said, Behold, your sister-in-law is gone back unto a people and unto a gods. Return, or you also, to your sister-in-law. But verse number 16 is where I'm closing tonight. And I'm going to put a finger there. And Ruth said to Naomi, Don't push me to let me leave you or return from following you. Because wherever you go, I shall go. Wherever you stay, I'm going to stay. But above all, your God shall be my God. In the name of Jesus. I'm going to speak to this nation of God in David in Orange Farm, Fred, everywhere you are watching me. I want to speak for the next few minutes and believe in God to make a difference. I'm going to use for a simple subject today. You need to be delivered from some people. You need to be delivered from people. You need to be delivered from people. You need to be delivered from people. You need to be delivered somewhere. You need to be delivered. I will Why not say that you are not a man? I believe in the next few minutes of God, somebody's life will never be the same. In Jesus' mighty name, everybody shout, Amen. You need to be delivered from other people. All right. Very soft. You can follow me with your strings. The rest of the guys can take a break. You've done well. Uh, we are just going to talk about deliverance. We are going to talk about deliverance. I know I will have to do a lot of explaining because to some people, deliverance is from a demon. To other people, deliverance. To you, it's what a demon is. But the demon, 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 the 
Ozamokshukti namtla di pisha pungza mukha zago wigoti amanya matimone avame wigoti abe pagati kumpilo yako besu hambu chela ban tu timu nanga matimone kanjabo ta wona matimone se kuli matimone lia pi wigoti luko na pagati guako and you need to realize wigoti matimone bato namba se kaya maybe imimo yobumnyama ya guazo kubambana unga guazo kutuye pambili umangale ngamanda wonyi skate site kanti hii ninkinga kanti kwa ni imimo ya ekubambili i know we're gonna be talking about deliverance from the certain environments but that is not the topic for the day na mshanja wana talk about people because abanyo baba mbegi ili nja baba njwanga iluto maba tanda zelo nja kona bantu kumele ba shukane na abo and unga ka shukane na ilu wa mtu usazo ba ili ntoi hiyo for the for the past 19 years, logo hamba na logo hamba kuchela ba nuthe. Mina na mlo muto amesuka gote. Mara nsuka gote taka globali, aga leti nenda ulo, aga bali jengshe nengwa tinya nuthi nzovela. Maga ne malo tengi korokoro zama uno zopa galapendli. Pata gai kaba nguto eno intoksha tu. Nuko taka fage ring. Nyambonge lango baga shatanga waso shangan. Waso shangan ni mausha tinga ni akona maishoni lunga ilobolanga. Bati pogi sale shonga gam globali. Eni mangu na nkomo zogum lobola. Bati mta chombege nzi nzas chela maso ne nkomo mlo bo lebe sisi amuaba ngamanya makama ba zamu kumbi suguti umuntu abu ba legi le football zomluwe la noma ina ngaseko senga tu ngashcheli ndoto tifuteli ndoto tena ngaglo bo la peka yambugele kaya wicha luguta ni ngaela ngaela luguta mlo bo la dawaisi angfunu tu ngashate mina ngasabo numshato wami ni lele poxi ni ngashcheli la namba tu make his the price of vulu ngas nuko tu vuli veilu vuli pogi isi beso kabu zinte ngaseko kwa tuwe ngata amenigle sonto you need to realize this morning kuti some of the people abashle lana you need to be delivered from people abang afun ugut bukubegele pambila abang imbazi ba afun but minang sagwa zi guti nsuga ni nala bantu mwabala bantu nsuga guti ngazi ngabuzo mbuzo minang ati man nsuga guti po waini ngayi guti mwabang yanbona ngempela nkamuga guti pat nyanpega minang nimenda wonye ani guti kandoku balegi la kusuk suga uguya maunga kwa zuguya guti you are wasting your own time so it's important guti noman kuluma ningabali minyaga la nsuga kona because impilo na impilo umontu ina lente si bizu guti history in history it's what i'm going to be talking about today but also after history there's what we call a destiny so the reason why god has anointed me and has called me and i've taken my call very very serious it was because god has told me yeah, we are not even shown jalo. We are going to track and transport a bantu from the from their history to their destiny. We are going to share the share the corner. You are stuck in your past. We share the answer in your past, but I go into hambayo. Empire ni ako tuye pambil. But you need a man of God that is anointed, that is called by God, that has got grace to tow you from where you are. Abu is at your destiny. And I'm sure you're saying, "Bonka bantu ba kolwa." You could God has anointed me. He ba bantu ba zokala ba sugar. Kalanga zimshame ba kona pamgwa. Mshame na ba lapet Davidon bang bo na mshamba se orange famanga zba menga gopi but lamanta ba kolo e pansu glo kabo this anointing will carry you from your past from your history lasen fumelele ko na gini gutage kumuto gulunge lo ezito la ikaya bese ni afiga mina zoto mula ba ma ba kolo lo glo kabo ma ba the anointing God has given me to this day it is able to carry you from where you are to where you want to be chel makelo an salapan 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 that's right that's right so the anointing God has given me it is able to carry you to where where you are or where you've been and where your family is besukunukula sebenze lokqobo ukuthi uhluke phakathi komndeni wakini angazi mdume ngani lapha kini but ikhona itedumile lapha kini kuyaziwa ukuthi umshada ukho nonke nihlala kule forum akuna muntu othenga umuzi but namhlanje mawukholwa kulocqobo lizokuthabatha la ohlela ikhona bese uyaphuma nifuna ukungizwa lenta ngishoyi bese niyaphuma la nivaleleke khona labathi khona kini akekho ke wa graduate Age ko ngasha tengi moto, age ko kino ngage watolum shato white wedding. Patu ba umseben zwa mna lo kumu kulu kulang ninge zelona. Pata ko aigu onku moto bo bo kaba taba kolo ayo. Good, this anointing has been fabricated for me. God has brought this anointing. Good, zigu azu kulu la mina. Bo kaba taba kolo ayo. Let this anointing that is upon my life start from where you are to where you want to be. I'm talking to all the children of destiny, those who believe that I deserve better than this. Those who believe that like, he didn't bring me this far to let me die here. But there's something better that God has put for me. I'm saying this morning once again, let this anointing ikitate from landstake kone mtenilu wakini. Besa niya lau sumagate afunukuni isa kona. Shaurie.
Ah, oh, deliverance. Shall we call it deliverance? Yeah. Iminyaga ngabena unkolokolo ngi Pauli lugna lugunkolokolo unkolokolo sengi mbonili busi so nazo rest assured ngi zbonili ngi zbali le ngazbon unkolokolo na elite but busi sabati blessing unkolokolo ya panangai but what God does not do He will never bless you until He has delivered you. For God to bless you, He will have to move you from somewhere to somewhere. I'm taking you to a land that is flowing with milk and honey. I can bless you where you are, but for you to know that I'm God, I want you to bless you where you're not gonna be. A slave but where you are even though I bless you they will take your blessing because you still have a slave mentality from where you are what I call the grace of God but the grace of God has been good to me and it brought me where I am this morning. Shout it, amen. The Lord will fetch you from your where you are stuck, your history, your background. Labafunga kon gin gin aiki milone ukulukula tomule pagatguabo agulotenge mali pagatguabo ngabukulukula simkozayo is the God of fruita ba ke ba shuge unga vumu shupega seng figile unga vumu ngabini mali unga vumu tonsa kanzima ngabawaku muto tonsa kanzima you should know who the put out when you are a child of God when you are a tongue speaking spirit filled child of the living God it is not right for you to suffer you need to have all that you need because God has given you uh, yeah, yeah, yeah.